Hey guys, Coach John here coming to you outside with a little outside warrior workout. Uh, some good news, it's supposed to be beautiful for the next few days here in the Ozarks and the Republic and uh, the community. So get outside and enjoy it. Uh, of course, ask for your parents' permission uh, to go outside. If you need somebody to be supervising you, of course, have them come out with you. Uh, but came up with some ideas for things we can do out in the driveway uh, or so forth. Um, so the first thing, or what you're gonna need actually is sidewalk chalk, if you got it because you're gonna draw an agility ladder if you don't have an agility ladder. If you have an agility ladder and don't have a sidewalk check, just use that. Uh, a little ruler to help with the drawing process. You're also going to need a jump rope. Don't have to have a jump rope. If you don't have one, we can do it without a jump rope. That's fine. And then dice, okay? So we've done a few things with dice this week. We're gonna do it again. It's just an easy way to figure out what you guys need to do. So first thing, we're gonna do house laps, okay? So depending upon your situation at your house, that can either be a lap around the whole house, which works great at my house, or you could do a yard lap. So say you need to go in the backyard, do a lap around your, you know, inside of your fence or whatever the situation is, everybody's house is different, but figure that out. So do a lap and then roll the dice, okay? So the roll the dice exercises for today are gonna be jumping jacks. You can either do no rope jump ropes or jump rope with the rope. Uh, clown crunches, high knees, feet switches and lunges, okay? So for a quick demo on those, jumping jacks, okay? No rope jump ropes or grab the jump rope, okay? Clown crunches, these are funny. Like that, feet or high knees, back and forth. Feet switches, go, uh, you know, pick a line in the driveway or something. Feet switch like that. And then lunges, you can do step back, or if you want to go a little faster, you can do jumping lunges. Just be careful because you're going to be on concrete, so we want to do anything that's going to be too explosive, maybe have you fall, okay? You're going to do that three times. So three laps. Every time you come back and roll, you're going to do each thing 10 times. So I'm going to go ahead and roll here. Got a four. I'm going to do four high knees. One, two, three, four, all the way to 10, okay? All right. Next thing, the jump rope challenge. Okay, so that's when you're gonna grab your jump rope, if you got it. You're gonna try to get the 50 jumps without making a mistake, okay? If you can do 50 jumps with no mess ups, then you can just take a little breather and restart. But if you make a mistake, keep going all the way till you get to 50, but then you're going to do 10 tuck jumps as a penalty before you restart again, okay? So I'm gonna do my 50 jump ropes, I make it all the way, I just take a breather, I go to the second round. If I mess up during it, I keep going, but then when I get to 50, for a penalty, I'm gonna have to do 10 tuck jumps, okay? You can really do that as many rounds as you want, but I put on the board uh, three of them, okay? Next thing is driveway line tag. So everybody's driveway is gonna be different. Um, we actually just happen to have a lot of lines in our driveway how our house is set up. If you had less lines, you can use the corner where it hits the grass as, as one of your lines. So this is how you're gonna do it. There's a couple of different things you can do. You can, if you're by yourself, you don't have any siblings, um, you can just pick a starting point and an ending point and try to get there as fast as you can. But the thing about driveway line tag, it's speed walking, it's not running. You gotta just fast walk. If you fall off of the line, that's a penalty. So. If you fall off of the line trying to beat your best time, you gotta do 10 of the clown crunches, okay? Um, and, and be careful, it's it's concrete, so we don't wanna go too fast and fall down and you know skin a knee or something, okay? Now, if you have siblings, you guys can play tag, okay? So I'm gonna switch real quick and let Ashlyn and Isabella show this off real quick. Let them play that quick game of line tag. Okay, so my girls are gonna demo here. All right, so Isabella's gonna start at some point. Ashlyn's gonna start at a different point, and Ashlyn or Isabella's gonna try and speed walk and get her. But she has to stay on the lines. If they come off the lines, then, you know, if she gets tagged or falls off the line, that's what she'll do, the crunches, okay? And honestly, you guys could do this for as long as you want. You can do it for, a long time, just whatever until uh, you decide you want to move on. And then the next thing is agility ladder. So my girls uh, did a little craft here, obviously, and 
drew out the agility ladder. They did a great job. Here's what you're going to do on the agility ladder. Really, you can do whatever you want. Uh, but you're going to do in and out. is the first thing. So in, out, in, out, in, out, in, out, in, out. The whole way down. Okay? Okay? Do it a couple times. Then you're going to move on to jumps. So don't jump too far because we don't want anybody falling again. But uh, let's say we're going to skip one every time. So frog jumps, skipping all the way down, and then go back. Uh, the other one that we're going to do is squat jumps. So what you're going to do, you're going to get down to squat position, touch inside the ladder, up, down, up, down, up. So you're going to touch in each box as you go all the way down. Okay? Now a couple of things you can do when you get to the end, you can turn around or go backwards. Okay? So I'd say go through those sequences like three times to be the goal. Okay? Or as many times as you want. Um, and then start over. So all these things, there's a lot of flexibility. You can do them for long periods of time, whatever you guys want to do, but just some ideas to get you guys active for today. Okay. Uh, hope everyone's doing good and we'll see you soon.